Good evening Hackology and welcome to tonight's episode. We're carrying on with the Android theme in this video and in tonight's tutorial I'm going to show you how to change the boot animation screen on your Android device. Now on the Sony Xperia X10 the boot animation is kept in system forward stroke media. On your device it may differ, you might have to Google to find out where it is but you can always check to see that it's there and present using ADB. So in tonight's tutorial I'm going to show you using Windows and I've got some screen capture working. I've also set it up in Debian and got the screen capture working on there so I'll show you Linux the next time we come to do another Android tutorial. Um, but <clears throat> let's get started. Let's get the screen capture running. Okay, so I've got the screen capture running. The first thing you'll need to do is change into the Android SDK directory, go into Platform Tools and run ADB Devices. Check your device is listed and it's been detected. If not, go and Google. Right, next thing to do is run ADB space shell. Right, make sure you're a super user and then run the mount RW script. Ah, from the right directory, from the SD card. Okay, then CD forward stroke system forward stroke media, which is where the boot animation is kept on the Sony X10. If it, yours isn't in system media, You'll probably need to do a little bit of googling to find it. And then what we're going to do is ls the files. There's the boot animation. And we're going to cb boot anim animation dot zip two forward stroke sd card forward stroke boot anim dot bkup. Right. Once we've done that, we're going to copy the new animation in. So boot, copy, forward stroke SD card, forward stroke, boot, animation, dash, BIOS, dot zip. Oh, and we're going to copy that into forward stroke system, forward stroke, media, forward stroke, um, forward stroke media, forward stroke boots, animation, dot zip. And last of all, don't forget to remount your SD card as um, read only. Leave it in the state that you found it. So I'm going to sh mount r o dot sh, and that mounts the file system back as uh, read only, which is its normal state. So uh, if you want a copy of the scripts, check the last video that we did on removing stock applications from a rooted Android. Your device will need to be rooted um, to. Um, change the boot animation, don't bother if you haven't got a rooted phone. Tonight I've done it on Windows, the last video was done on Linux. We've got one more video planned for the um, Android handset and then we'll be moving on to some different things. I hope you've enjoyed tonight's episode. Peace as always and have fun hacking. We'll see you soon. This nice phone is slow, it's the original X10. Either that or I've just bricked it. I doubt it. Hey! And now you can see the um, Android by a screen loading on the droid. I'll hold it there because it's, it's more in focus. So there you go. There you have it. That's how to install 
custom boot animations on a rooted Android device. I take no responsibility if you brick your handset by the way. Um, peace, we'll see you soon.